video let me give you a brief introduction about tosca test suit what is tosca test suit what are the advantages disadvantages of your tosca test suit so the topics which i'm going to talk what is tosca test suit the comparison of tosca with other test automation tools like selenium qtp what are the advantages and disadvantages of tosca test suit okay so let us start about uh, what is tosca test suit so tosca test suit is a test automation tool automation testing tools uh, developed by tricentis okay uh, uh, past almost uh, 10 plus years they are in the market but uh, you, you must be hearing about tosca since last three or four years or max five years okay so uh, the current version of tosca is version 12 and they have done lot many improvements and lot they have added lot many features in tosca test suite. so it is a test automation tool uh, where you can automate your almost all kinds of application whether it is your G gui application like your web application or desktop application or your non gui application such as your xml uh, or any other json or might be your uh, sap application might be your mainframe application uh, whether it is mobile testing uh, whether it is a load testing almost uh, tri uh, tricentis is trying to cover all the things in this complete package tosca test suit okay so it is a test automation tool where you can perform lot many kind of testing activities uh, it is a test management tool uh, okay why it is test management tool because normally we use QC uh, as our test management tool where we write our test cases where we execute our test cases on the similar line Tosca test suit can be used to perform your manual testing as well where, where you can create or record your manual test cases you can execute your manual test cases as well uh, it is a management tool like uh, till now we were using quality center to add our requirement <coughs> excuse me and nowadays we are using jira where we do add our user story and all those things okay but in tosca test suit as well you can do all the things like you can do a planning test planning you can do a uh, uh, you, you can add the requirements you can link the requirements to your uh, test cases you can link the requirements to your uh, test execution list okay so linking the requirement gives you the status of the uh, actual current status of the uh, particular requirement what's the like how, how many percentage of test cases are written for this specific requirement how many number of percentage of test cases are executed for this requirements o out of that what are, what what is past percent fail percent everything we will be getting because we are we, we are linking the requirements to a uh, test cases and execution list so that's how it is a test management tool as well as the management tool where it it uh, it, it produce a good dashboard to see uh, what and all requirements are covered what's the current status and all those things the biggest advantage is it is a scriptless test automation tool okay and it makes the test case more readable okay so just like uh, how you re read the manually written test cases on the similar line not exactly but very good way you can read the test cases in very good way you can read the test cases which are there in tosca test suit okay so we'll be talking about uh, uh, how it makes more readable uh, in actual whenever uh, I, I start actual creation of my test cases maybe in uh, video fifth or sixth it supports as i said it supports your manual test cases as well it supports your automated test case whether it is your gui non gui it supports mobile legacy applications sap most of the technologies are supported so tricentis um, uh, if you if you go to tricentis.com they have them they have mentioned it supports more than 100 plus i don't remember exact count but it is 100 plus okay 100 plus technologies are supported by this tricentis tosca test suit it supports load testing as well so from version i believe version uh, 11 uh, they have added a new feature called as tricentis flood okay which is uh, like which can be used to perform the load testing okay uh, so this is what your tosca test suit is it is a scriptless test automation tool by tricentis and you can perform almost all the testing activities whether it is manual testing automation testing planning test management most of the things almost all the things are possible with the help of tosca test suit also it's, it supports your CI/CD continuous integration continuous delivery or deployment is supported by Tosca test suit so uh, 
uh, in this image from uh, it is from tricentis documentation so in this image you can see what and all things are supported by tricentis tosca test suit so the biggest thing is um, it is scriptless max test case readable and it is model based test automation okay so i'll talk about what is model based test automation whenever i create my first test case okay uh, but the thing is model based test automation is nothing but model based as the name is suggesting you model best so like how the model looks to you how the particular scenario looks to you on the similar model you will see your test cases okay you will you'll, you'll get more clarity about this model based in coming uh, two three sessions so what and all we can do with Tosca test suit okay so we can do API testing yes we can do BI testing okay so this BI testing and big data testing is like uh, it is made very easy but the license cost for this BI and big data add-ons are um, big huge so I'm not sure how many organizations do prefer that but uh, yeah, the BI testing and big data made very much easier with the help of this Tosca test suit again it supports your continuous automation it has a internal test data management where you can create your you can create your test data and store it in Tosca test suit itself okay so I'll be showing you how we can do that then uh, it supports the load testing as I said uh, you can do the impact analysis there is uh, something called as Tosca OSV orchestrated service virtualization where you can virtualize your service um, if required uh, in some cases if your service is not available or it is too costly or service failure might, might be any reason if you want to virtualize that specific service maybe due to cost constraint or if it is an it is not developed or it is unavailable then you can virtualize um, virtualize the scenarios with the help of Tosca OSV you can perform exploratory testing you can record the like Tricentis has given you a good UI uh, how you can uh, record the exploratory testing scenarios which can be referred for later purpose uh, risk based testing we can prioritize the requirements based on that we can perform risk based testing test management as I said we can perform manual testing as well you can create test cases you can write test cases you can uh, have attachments all, all the test management activities can be done in Tosca test suit as well you can do the manual testing okay so uh, these are all the things not not only these many there are few more things which are possible with the help of Tosca test suit so I'll be talking about those things when as and when it comes into picture okay but in, in a broader view these are the things uh, which makes Tosca test suit unique okay so uh, I just tried to compare uh, this Tosca test suit with some other test automation tools okay so uh, let me talk about the type so Tosca test suit is a vendor tool by Tricentis QTP is by Microfocus Selenium is open source cost wise Tosca is very much costlier as compared to your uh, QTP uh, but the cost is again based on the nego negotiation based on organization to organization based on how much how, how many license they want and all, all, all those sales discussion uh, whereas your selenium is open source anyone can use it they are just the selenium api selenium jars you can download and you can work type of the application tosca supports almost all the kinds of the applications qtp supports your web and desktop application whereas selenium supports your web application only automation type it is model based QTP is script based you cannot understand the scripts just by reading it whereas if it is a model based you can easily uh, read the test cases selenium is again code based you may not be able to read and understand the test cases if you are a non techie uh, scripting required for a Tosca test suit for almost 99% of the scenarios there is no need to do a coding or scripting but in uh, in 1% in very rare scenarios you might need to do a coding uh, to develop special execution task okay and when we need it and why we need it I'll be having separate video for that uh, for QTP and selenium yes you need if for QTP you use VB for selenium you use Java Python C sharp many API testing is possible with Tosca QTP 
with selenium as well not exactly with selenium uh, but uh, with the help of http client or rest assured it, that that's not a selenium but with some other uh, open source uh, apis api testing is possible test data management tosca has its internal tool but not other other uh, automation tools have it exploratory testing is very much possible uh, and it gets recorded in tosca test suite uh, tricentis has a dedicated support for tosca again for qtp even this uh, micro focus have but for this tosca you know you can you can just have a chart or you can raise a ticket chart chart is a very great uh, way uh, how you inter how, how you can ask your questions to Tos uh, tricentis support team continuous integration nowadays continuous integration plays very important role that is must nowadays so tosca supports any ci tool qtp and selenium again uh, they both supports most of the ci tools okay not only jenkins my apology here i need to update qc jira integration with tosca it is possible with qtp and uft qc integration is very much possible but for jira you need to write some external you, you need to depend on external dependencies again for selenium yes it is possible with the help of uh, jira rest api but again that's a third party dependency uh, for which you need you need to write some script and you will get connected okay so th this is where i tried to compare that uh, tosca test suite with other automation tools uh, so by look tosca looks very much better but the thing is only uh, it is a bit costly nowadays most of the organizations go for selenium okay because for selenium there is a, uh, a huge uh, what i can say resources available in the market as well as uh, on internet as well you can find the huge material and selenium supports many technologies right it supports java python and all the things but though tosca has its own feature own uniqueness okay uh, it is a scriptless it supports uh, it's the complete bundle okay so you can perform maximum of the activities in single tool itself so that's the complete bundle so tosca has its own uniqueness so you will you will learn about tosca uh, step by step in this uh, series of videos uh, now what are the advantages of Tosca? I have talked the same till now. It is scriptless. You need not to have coding in 99% of the cases. It is a one-stop solution for your all test activities. So that's what I, I was talking till now. It is a uh, Tosca test suite is a desktop application where by just by using your drag and drop you can create your test cases. Okay, by scanning the particular you, you, by scanning your application your application under test you can create a modules and by uh, using by dragging and dropping those modules into your test cases you can create your uh, test steps. Okay. Um, it is a complete test management tool. That's what I was talking till now risk based approach. We have a, a requirement section where we can prioritize the requirements and based on and the uh, requirements holding highest risk. We go with that first. It is a model based. It supports your GUI and non GUI application. Does not require explicit framework. This is the big advantage again. So if I if I started my project in Selenium or QTP, my first uh, ten days go in. Uh, writing explicit framework i i write a code to read my excel i write a code to take a screenshot uh, uh, various thing i do okay i write some common methods I, I do many thing okay in the framework but for tosca there is no need of explicit framework on the very first day you can start your automation but uh, as I said, it supports more than 100 technologies. You can refer to tricentis.com for this. It supports DevOps and it has a good vendor support. You can you can reach to the tricentis support team via chat, via uh, you can raise a ticket incident on support.tricentis.com. You can send the email. They are quite appreciable. Disadvantages I see pricing because I personally observed this in couple of organizations because of the pricing. they they think before go for tosca okay and it's a heavy tool but nowadays they are just improving the performance so uh, in version 12 they have bit improved the performance of while while performing the application scanning okay so you will see that okay so that's what about uh, tosca test suit what is tosca test suit and 
about uh, some of its advantages and disadvantages okay so not a doubt tosca test suite is a great tool because uh, they have given all the things into a single a single bel uh, bundle and definitely it is a scriptless many will go with that okay so thank you